Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Okay, oh, Casey. He's doing it. Casey, oh, you just God. bought that t-shirt. What the fuck are you doing? It needs to be made better. <laughs> what, what, why? I was actually, I was talking with... What's wrong with sleeves? I was talking with Pat, the vocalist of this band, Hunger. I was like, what kind of shirts do you guys have? He's like, they're t-shirts, but I don't even fucking know why we make t-shirts, because as soon as anyone buys them, they just cut the sleeves off anyway, so why don't you just do it before the show? <laughs> what's your, Casey, remind us, what's your personal slogan again? Sleeves are for suckers. That's right, kids. Sleeves are for suckers. Yeah. Fuck That's em. right, motherfucker. So, uh, as soon as we woke up from Kayla's house, which we were very appreciative to have been able to stay in, we uh, pretty much woke up, got back in the van, and started driving on our way to uh, Calgary to play our next show. And uh, lots of stupid jokes, just like the last video. Yay! Great. Just like some guy spitting water, he's like, Kenny's laying down, or Spenny's laying down, and Kenny's like, on water, sitting like this. Spenny's like... Like spitting water up into his mouth or into his ass. Oh, yeah, it's awesome. It's hilarious. Kenny versus Penny. It's epic. Wanna tell us about that, Casey? <laughs> Used to be a b-boy. I was a backup dancer on Living Color. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was a flying girl. You got some. You got some sick breakdown moves. Yellow or like this. Song. What a pimp. Unfortunately, not quite like that, but. Uh, but almost. Yes. Yeah, not literally. Is she still a girl from the Bronx? Uh oh, she's dead from the block. Jenny from the block. Yeah, this is Jenny from the block. Yo! She's. But I. Except for disgusting yourself. Yeah, I used to work in like these uh, big steel toed boots, like rubber, and they'd collect and keep all the heat and moisture inside, and then it just built up over eight hours. By the end of the day, my foot looked like a giant wrinkled ball. Like you couldn't even really tell what were toes anymore. And uh, yeah, it took like three days for it to like dry out. And it cracked, and then when it walked, like the cracks would bleed. It was really hardcore. That's fucking metal as hell. That's metal. Needless to say, I threw the boat, boots out. Oh no, shit. Then I went with steel toed loafers. Did they get filled with pus? No. There wasn't any pus? No. That's all this point. That would have been, been metal. Next time. Pass all me right. the peanut butter right about now. <laughs> right about now? Yes, right about now. Pass me the peanut butter right about now. Right about when? Yes, right about now. Pass me the peanut butter right about now. There's more towns in the province of Saskatchewan than there is in any other province of Canada. And there's more uh, highways, more roads. What is that? No, really, a peregrine falcon is a falcon? Yeah, that's a I, that, that surprises the shit out of me, I never would have guessed. So, Kyle. What, are you calling me an idiot? Yeah, maybe I am, Jesse, what are you going to do about it? So, Kyle, how's it going? Good. How long have we been in the van for today? Uh, two hours. Too fucking long, that's right, Aaron. Too fucking long, how fucking many hours? Long. Like six. Like six, hours. seven hours. What a quarter one. Feels good. Max. We're somewhere in Alberta now. We're in the homeland. We're in the homeland of Titan's Eve. On our way to Calgary. It's or we're playing a show. Snow. Or Calgary, I should say. Calgary. Although nobody calls the flames the Calgary Flames. Calgary. That's my one beef with people calling it Calgary. Calgary. Like the Calgary Flames Vancouver. versus the Vancouver Canucks. That, that sounds weird to me. It's like the Calgary Flames. But maybe it's because I'm born in Vancouver. That's probably why. That's probably why. Man. That's probably why. Because the Flames suck. And the Flames do suck. They have a illustrious lineage, but they're disappointing. Jerome again was getting fucked. He does not need to be on that team. That's true. Oh! Pineapples. Potassium. Increase the taste. Increase the taste? They don't make it better, they just make it more Increase it, the taste. Increase the taste. It Improve the taste. Yeah. And then uh, curry makes it spicy. Yeah. It's hot. Look at this motherfucker! Yeah! I am the Muad Dib. Three! I'm the Sayadina. We're up on the mountain, we're driving through a mountain pass, and look at this. Driving through a misty mountain pass. Look at this guy. We're in the hall of the mountain king right now. And uh, there's a fuckload of trees, fog settling in, 
We just passed the uh, scariest curve in all of the highway, right, Jesse? There was a car yeah. flipped right upside down. There was a car fucking upside down. And the ambulance shit was fucked. So I put my seatbelt on. Oh. That's being responsible. I was so... What a good boy. I was worried. I was worried. And I have this fucking leopard print blanket and shit because I'm a... I'm a pen. Big boy. That's when I'm not in the van. I'm a, I'm a professional pen. And I uh, run an escort service. Jess is one of my male, uh, male employees. They call me BT. I got baby teeth. <laughs> you think your real dad's gonna stick around with a little shit like you? Huh? Uh, yeah, he would have if he hadn't abandoned me, which for smokes never came back, you well, asshole. I don't blame him. Wish it could have been me, because I am sick of it. Sick You're of sick it. of it. You're sick of it. I'm the one who's living in the closet. You fucking <laughs> oh, shut It's up. not my fault. I have to work two jobs and you eat so goddamn much. It's not my fault you feed me till I get fat and know the girls don't want to have sex with me. Oh, they don't have sex with me. They just have to have money. <laughs> well, so I get don't have any money. I don't sex. need a job because I've got a rich dad who's going to be Well, maybe if you do something for me, son, maybe I can hook you up with some money. You're not my <laughs> real dad, so you get fucked. Exactly. So yeah, it's not insect. <laughs> You're never there for me, Mom! You're never there for me! <laughs> That's enough. Yeah. We're in Calgary at the end of the show. Saul is an idiot, and um, yeah. That's about it. I'm twiddling my beard. Why is Saul an idiot? No, I'm kidding. Because he's uh, ranting about Calgary and Calgary that doesn't fucking matter. Why am I? Shit! Tell us something. I've written excellent lyrics for. What is it? Of her and each time. Yeah. Yeah. We're still waiting for an update from uh, the Seven Gates. Hopefully, we'll know something tonight. Thank <laughs> you.